Hi, Miss Dunbar and Amelia here. We're going to read you Mess Monsters. One day, Mummy, Mummy said that my room was a mess, and because it's untidy, she suffers from stress. I said I need the mess because it's better that way. If I tidied my room, I just wouldn't play. What I didn't know was that under my bed was a big gang of monsters who'd heard what I'd said. A claw, then a paw, then a horrible sight as masses of monsters crawled into the light. The terrible monsters made terrible noise as they crashed and they smashed up all of my toys. They broke all my games and before I was ready, they jumped on my cars and they clobbered poor Teddy. They leaped on my bed and they chewed all my sheets, then squished all my clothes with, a big, with their big smelly feet. <laughs> they banged down their tails so the whole bedroom shook. They stomped on my cushions and ate all my books. Enough was enough, so I shouted, Oi, stop! They are my things, you're breaking. I want you to stop. I'll clean and I'll tidy. I'll sweep up all day if that's what is needed to send you away. You'll go if it's clean. You don't like it that way. You only like mess. Well, that's what mum would say. The horrible monsters frowned at each other. They knew that I'd, I'd lose in a fight with my mother. They panicked and ran when they heard what I'd said, back to the mess at the end of my bed. Now I tidied, now I tidied, now I tidy my room, every nook, every crack. I want to make sure that they'll never come back. The end. Have you tidied your room? Bye.